And it goes a little bit like this. Welcome back to Calf Drama, folks. A huge week here. It snowed and allegedly may or may not have been the cause of the pipes freezing or it could have been Joe Hawk's fault. No one's really sure about it, but the depot was closed for one day due to frozen pipes, but they back up now. Uh, secondly, two omelets this week, notably only one omelet by Olga though, Lynn was slinging on Friday. Very good omelet I can say though. That's all I got for you this week. Go Lions, go Thunder. Welcome to Non-Engineering New of the Week. I'm currently filling in for our boy, Big Mike, and boy, did we, did we have quite a week for you. First off, classes canceled Tuesday due to the freezing cold, plus shuttles offered by the one, the only, the man, the myth, the legend, Cisco Ortiz. So the business students got off, got a day off from the coloring books. Engineering students still got to put that work in. And then, of course, Friday, we had quite a hockey game, folks. Went into overtime. Might have been some chicanery due to the refing, but who's to say a legend? A legend. And also, Winter Thunderland, happening in our future or your past, depending on when you're watching this, may or may not be a banger. Who's to say? You'll find out more next week. Anyway, go Lions, go Thunder! Adam Answers Yes, sponsored by... Welcome back to Quote of the Week. Man, it was a great week this week. And now, here's your quote, and it goes a little something like this. They weren't just balls, there were weights too. Well, that's a Quote of the Week for you. Take care, stay on the grind, go Lions, and go Thunder! Ladies and gentlemen of the press, I welcome you back. First of all, I would like to address the throne. The absolute monstrous ice sculpture sitting outside. It's a beautiful sight and Chan can attest. It is extremely, extremely comfortable. Uh, secondly, I'd like to address that I forgot what I'd like to address. Uh, I'll open up to questions now. Brett Smalls here from Toledo Blade. Quick question for you. So there's been a hot topic issue on campus about a certain holiday that's about to come up. So I want to present this to you, oh great Travis. Is Valentine's Day a scam? Yes, next question. <clears throat> Johnny Sullivan here from the Oxford Gazette. I've received reports that you got absolutely shellacked in tennis earlier today. Some would say, it was even more embarrassing than the Falcons lost to the Patriots in the Super Bowl. What do you have to say about this? <clears throat> First of all, I'd like to say that he quit. I was getting absolutely shellacked. I was getting embarrassed, bamboozled, befumbled. And then he quit, which means he was scared because I was coming back. And that's all I got to say. Have a great week, folks. I'm Caleb Cruz. I'm Michael Cruz. And we approve this message. Take it easy. <laughs> Take it easy.